Hi there, it's Ghost here. Today I'm doing Back to the Future Playmobil. Hello again. So, yeah, if you watched my Christmas video, you would have seen that I got the uh, Scooby Doo Playmobil figures. And I mentioned in that video that for my birthday I actually got a Back to the Future uh, set. And that was this one. Which is the uh, DeLorean, and it also comes with Doc Brown, Einstein, and Marty in there as well. So that's the one I got in November for my birthday. Um, I actually saw today that in Tesco they're selling this for £25, which is a bargain. So uh, if you want to get this set, get down there and get that quickly. And then um, I saw on Smith's today in their sale they had the Back to the Future advent calendar and as you can see reduced to £20 from £22 um, on Amazon it actually goes for 30 so about a tenner off really and this is really good value um, I won't show you what's on the back actually because it shows you the bits and I'm going to open that with you in a minute I haven't opened this box yet uh, but for all, all the bits you get in there what is it 97 pieces uh, for £20 that's a really good deal and then I went into the entertainer toy shop and got the last one which it completes the whole set I think um, and it's the uh, 1955 edition Marty and Doc although you do get the Doc in the advent calendar which I thought was a bit silly uh, the same figure with the uh, gloves and the newspaper um, so yeah you get Marty McFly with his guitar and his um, under the sea dance clothes so that was seven pounds so yeah if I just show you the uh, DeLorean first so this is it you get it in uh, pieces and you have to build it up um, and there's also uh, a light so you can turn that on and it flashes you can see the uh, flux capacitor at the back there so yeah looks pretty cool or you can set it just to, to be on and um, this is the, the lightning rod, which obviously you can remove, it goes into the back. And then you also have the um, nuclear uh, power fusion thing, which you plug into the back as well. So uh, obviously the doors open up like that. And then it's Marty inside driving it. The wheels go round and also you can change the wheels so that they they go into flying mode so you can have the wheels that way round which is a really cool little feature as well so you can have it either flying or driving so yeah and then they just click back into place and that's the uh, DeLorean you also get Doc Brown with his um, radio control device for the car, his little bag and device there. He's also got little features like a watch on. Uh, he's actually got two watches, the present time and the past. You also get Einstein, his dog, and a couple of little extras. You get the um, camcorder, which they use to film going into the future or in the past, uh, Marty's skateboard and a plutonium box which has a couple of extra cases inside. So yeah that's what you get in the, in this one. Let's uh, unpackage the advent calendar. So push these ones back. So like I said I haven't opened this one yet so let's have a look what we've got. So we open the box and we've got the advent calendar itself. 1 to 24. Showing you that you can also get the um, the car and the figures on the back. And then also inside we have a 
the manual. And some extra bits here. Open that in a minute. Okay, so it looks like you also get, that's pretty cool. Uh, so you get like the, the clock tower to build as well. I'll do that separately off camera. Yep. So yeah, you get sort of like a, a cardboard watch tower to build, clock tower. Um, like I said, I'll build that in a minute. And we've got a couple of extra things in here as well. It looks like the wire which he slides down and the telegraph pole. Yeah, so we've got like a pole. I'm thinking that's the wire which he slides across or is it what the car hooks onto? And what looks like a um lamp post. And I think so another I'm guessing these are curbs for this side of the road. Open up this packet. Yeah, so we've got some, these might be spare parts, I'm not sure. Some little white bits and a clear piece. And some rubber bungs. Now this is really cool. This is a lentacular picture of Marty and his family. And as you can see, I hope you can see that. They disappear, but they fade away. Like on the film, that's a really nice touch. And then we've got the instruction manual, how to build a clock tower. And uh, all the bits in the back. So let's see what we've got inside here. So Christmas is finished, so we're gonna open them all up. Number one. Marty McFly. I think that's in his 1955 clothes when he meets his mum when she was younger. Number two. These are quite deep. It's quite a big box. So yeah, so we've got what looks like his guitar in this box, which is quite cool because that's a yellow one. In the uh, separate case, you get his red guitar. So I'm guessing this is his one from the 80s, which he plays at the beginning of the movie. So you also get a couple of little um, cuffs for the character. And then just click the guitar together. And there we go. Door number three. Big one. Oh, what is it's a double door. Oh uh, yeah. It looks like the uh, the speaker which he had in the first movie. So, yeah, there it is with the uh, stickers on it. So you've got the front of it and on the side, and you've got a little newspaper article that says. Brown Mansion Destroyed. So there, there's the uh, speaker to go with the guitar. Next we've got door number four. Another bag. Now this looks like the top of the lamppost, so I won't get that one out. I'll build that onto the lamppost in a bit. Number five. And it looks like lamppost pieces, so I'll just put those together. So, yep, yeah, tops of the lampposts. And what we are now, six down here. Good one, it's Marty's mum from the uh, 50s. Seven. 
So this looks like some accessories for her. So we've got, I'm not sure if there's some stickers somewhere, but we've got a couple of books, a purple one and a small white book. We've got some cuff parts. And we've got her handbag there. Number eight. It's a quite big one, but not that exciting. We got the uh, park bench. That would be a bit disappointing on a uh, day number eight. Number nine. And a small one. Now these are looks like bits for Doc Brown. So we've got a backpack which came in two parts, which you just click back together. So a little backpack. And also save the clock tower, which is like a little newspaper flyer which they gave they gave out in the film. Number ten. The man himself, it's Doc Brown. Do the same as yeah, it's the same as the one, oh no, he's got different hair. It's the same as the one you get with the DeLorean. But he's just got different hair, so he's got receding hair cut there. And he must be the one from the 50s. Same clothes and belt, but just different head. Number 11, down here at the bottom. We've got his uh, protective nuclear gas mask helmet, so I'm guessing that goes on here, that's why he's got the different shaped head, there we go, number 12, yeah. pretty good calendar, worth the money I'd say, uh, so these are the same things as you get for the dock on the other one, so you've got the, the two watches, a little bag and another nuclear petroleum thing to plug into the car, so I'll leave them in there for now. 13. So put one at the top. Oh, stickers in there. Oh, that's pretty cool. So you've got the, the Twin Pines Mall and the Lone Pine Mall, as you know. He runs over one of the trees. Um, when he goes back in time and then it changes the name of the shop and then you've got the sign in here so yeah built that and stuck all the stickers on it so we've got the the lane pines and the twin pines on the base like that so it stands up 14. to time number plate which I'm guessing they put in there because in the film when it dries off it leaves the number plate on the floor so there is a bit of doubling up on bits like the camp order here that's in the original set I've got but the outer time bit um, I didn't have so that's pretty cool but yeah like the um, you know like the watches and the bag and the plutonium stuff that's already in the DeLorean set so there we go 15 I think it's worth getting just for the extra figures now we have Marty in his yellow biohazard suit Bands. So yeah, there he is with his hat and he's got the little cuff bits on there as well with the nuclear sim symbols on it. So that's when he goes in and says he's uh, Darth Vader from the future. 17. So 17 didn't really want to open so I've had to rip it upwards. And inside we've got a little comic 
with um, the Darth Vader type guy on the front, and also it's like a drill and a is that his earphones? I think. Yeah. So he's got his his hair dryer. I think it's the hair dryer that looked like a gun. He's got his um, Walkman, which he uses to wake up his dad and the little comic with the picture of him on and then you can put the, the hat on him as well. So number 18. Looks like we got Biff. So here's the figure but you've got the cuffs and the collar to put on him. So there he is with his cuffs and collar to make up his jacket. And that's the evil Biff from the 50s. Number 19. We have the Enchantment Under the Sea poster board. So there we go. There's the board with the standing on the back. It says Saturday Night Dance Enchantment Under the Sea. Be there or be square. Nice little touch, it looks like the uh, the movie. 20. It's the wooden skateboard, so that's slightly different to... So that's the one from the 80s. And then we got the one from the 50s, which is the wooden one. Okay. <clears throat> it's got a little bit on the top which you can clip the feet of the uh, the character onto, so you can stand either side of it like that. But you can turn it round as well, so you can stand sideways. So you've got that. Twenty one. Another character, and we've got. This is Marty again, also 1955. So that must be his, is that his 80s game? I'm not sure. Yeah, so that's when he comes from the 80s, isn't it? And this is when he gets his 50s gear on. 22. Is. So you've got some rope, a little black tag, and some electric, which looks like the same pieces you get with the Ghostbusters one. So I'm not sure what that comes in use for. Uh, I'll find out in a bit. Number 23. have the letter from um, Marty to the dock and we've got some gloves as well. So this is the letter which he says on the front, do not open until 1985 and then tells him about how he dies. Okay and finally we've got number 24 down the bottom and it is dock. So he's the same as the one you get inside the, um, the, set, the single pack. But you do get the extra Marty in there. So there he is with his gloves on and holding the, the letter. So there we go. That's all the bits from the advent calendar. Now what I do is I build up the scene and I'll show you it after it's built. So here we are, that's everything set up. You actually have to fold all the um, the clock tower up to get it to look like this, which was quite tricky to do. It's all sort of 3D, you can see. Um, you've got the, the, the wire attached to the bit at the top, and that's the lightning which comes down. 
obviously it's attached to dock there and he can slide down the wire onto the um, lamp post and then you've got the um, bit there which the the car attaches to so then we've got all these different characters down here so we've got five different Martys um, three different docks and obviously I've got the, uh, the double which I'm going to leave in the box and um, yeah so there they are with the um, biohazard suits on there's the one with um, Einstein and the control for the car you got those extra bits we got Biff there at the front Marty Lorraine his mum from the 50s 50s Marty and Enchantment Under the Sea Marty so yeah it's so obviously Doc will come down here slides down to the bottom to connect up the power the DeLorean drives through the middle attaches onto there pulls out and flies away and there we go that's the uh, the complete so far Back to the Future Playmobil set and uh, I think it's pretty cool you've got the DeLorean box the double figure box and the advent calendar with all the extra little bits thanks for watching please remember to thumb up the video if you enjoyed it and leave me a subscribe if you haven't done so already and uh, let me know what you think of the Playmobil Back to the Future set thanks for watching See you soon.